Hello and welcome to part 33 of Roman with the Romans, the Civilization 5 Let's Play series. We are currently at war with the... Wow, we are the top civ in the game. Interesting. We're currently at war with the Ottomans. They have... Uh, oh, I forgot to get uh, cargo ships. Sorry, I'm, I'm always like this. <laughs> they have a large cultural lead on us. Uh, sorry, they have a large cultural lead and are potentially about to win the game. Wow, they're up to 98%. This is getting serious. So that's it, basically. We are just moving our troops into position to start harassing them, killing them, hopefully stopping them winning the game. What else? We're short in coal. I had a quick look at technology tree. Electricity is what we need for coal refinery. But actually, we're going to get something before that. Um, three of these offices. Plus one, plus coal. For every three refinery franchises, um, up to your franchise limit. So we're going to get plus one coal. I need to build nine of them. I guess uh, maybe we'll we'll do that first. I'm not sure if we'd get that done before we will get... Uh... I'll do this. I'll do this at the end of this turn um, in between movements. You guys will notice. But I'll probably build a good few of those offices to help with my coal. Because I need more ironclads, basically. Right, let's uh, promote people. Um, I, I'd be tempted to actually bypass this city and move straight for Istanbul. I think, uh, wow, the population this guy has, I just noticed. Yeah, but I don't like leaving cities in my background. Like, I might live to regret this. But, um, whatever. Wait a minute. I'm not sure they have logistics. Okay, they do, but this guy is a city attacker. Broadside, uh, combat strength versus cities, that looks good. Shrapnel rounds. Um, outside friendly territory, mobility, visibility. We'll just go for this broadside. Why is it called broadside? Combat strength versus cities. I would I would say like broadsiding another ship. I've never heard of broadsiding a city, but maybe that is the term to use. Drive up to drive up uh, sail, sail up to the city. Turn your broadside to the city. Use your cannons. Simple. Um, I wonder. We have a lot of new uh, boats coming in. They may be able to reach. Oh my God! I forgot. That's just cost me what? Maybe twenty percent bonus or something. I'm up to at this point. Um, okay, let's get. Let's get some of these guys surrounding this city. I'm not going to attack this time, but it's in the correct range. Yeah, we. I don't know. I guess let's just get them as close as possible. These guys will surround next time. Um, we'll put all these to sleep, though, just to speed this up. I'll move the Great Admiral down here just in case uh, some action needs to be taken. I would like to avoid uh, hitting the Aztecs if, if at all possible. Like, I'm not there to kill the Aztecs. In fact, I keep begging for peace. Like, if he'd only talk to me, he'd get quite the deal out of me. Like, I've, I literally just have no interest in fighting them. Yeah. We are friendly with everyone here, aren't we? Let's just pop into somebody's territory and heal up. Okay, the, the logistical plane, uh, pain of getting them through that straight is mostly over, so I can just go ahead and attack. Uh, go ahead and push them forward. Yeah, uh, should we send a ship up here as well? A uh, land ship, that is. Cargo ship, that's... Thank you for reminding me, game. So it's this city, I think, has all my bonuses. Uh, we'll go ahead and buy a hair, though, and ship it down. Okay, what jumps out as being a good trade? Maybe the Carthaginians. I hope to stay peaceful with them. Nothing else really jumps out at me too much. I would have loved to get some culture off someone. But 
That's fine. We'll just go ahead and trade with the Carthaginians. Is that all the boats? I, I, I just want to finish moving these boats before I move to a new theater. Ah, whatever. The game's not going to let me. So that's fine. Let's move everyone forward. We'll probably go after... No, we won't go after the tank. Um, Where's my machine gunners? Maybe I don't have machine gunners. I have a machine gun. I forgot to move him up again. Okay, so if I only have one machine gun there right now, another couple coming. Uh, we might as well get the artillery pieces on land. Yeah, I think uh, you'll be fine here. I have some doubts about leaving that cal cavalry there, but it's a bit late in the game for that. It's a bit late in uh, this movement to worry about. It. And I am slightly concerned. I want to get anti-aircraft up, up, up and ready here, just because they have the technology. We're about to get the aircrafts, I think. Yeah, they ha surely have the technology by now. Um, nothing personal, by the way, Genoa. He's given out to me for trespassing already. While in between turns, um. Yeah, I just want him to know it's nothing personal. Just, I'm here to save you, if anything. Oh, that's a mountain. Ouch. Okay, he could be in a bit of trouble. Like, these are these are a technology level ahead of me. Um, so, I should get ready to be killed there. In fact... What am I doing, really? I need to move more troops over into this war. So let's go ahead and do that. Uh, let's see, what are we going to leave? Any more logistics? Okay, let's get a... Oh, there's lots of machine gunners. Okay, let's get a couple of machine gunners. Um, yeah, just because he's close, uh, these guys can spread out over three of them, over two of them would be enough, actually. Let's move you there and get, get himself into the war. Right, what else? Another tank. Maybe one more of these guys. Okay, do I need to do anything about open borders or anything like that? Oh, I thought we had embassies. Okay, so it's not giving me the off option. This happened a uh, previous time. I'm just going to wait and see what happens next turn. I wonder if I have to be stationary at the start of the turn. I, I just really don't know. Okay, I think that's probably everything. I'm going to go have a look through the houses. There was something I meant to do. I'm sure I'll remember uh, once I start. That was it. I'm going to set up a lot of these offices uh, more than I already have. I'll spend a lot. Oh, I don't actually have that much money left. I might not spend too much given that I'm, in, um, I'm not making money anymore. We discovered a new technology. Flight. Um, so you missed the, the pop-up. I should have brought you back in time for the pop-up I think what do we get out we got paratroopers and more importantly we got planes triplanes and bombers now that's a uh, how much is that going to help us actually because we're not going to be able to reach either of our current targets took a bit of a battering up here uh, where's the notification here we go unit killed that cavalry man uh, I got a little too close to the action in fairness Ooh, and these artillery pieces are uh, that exposed. We don't. We have no good landing spot to get units in off the water either. So this could be a bit of a mess. Um, March. Okay. 
Yeah, I don't know how much he has to back this up. I wonder has he got a city right there. Well, I guess we're about to find out. Right, here we go. More logistics. Um, that's maybe about six ships we have. Where are these guys going? I should follow these because they're going to get themselves killed. Whereas if I back them up with a bit of help, uh, they could do some real damage. In saying that, who cares where they're going? We need to we need to go after the capital. Like it's It's the only place we're guaranteed to do damage at. Like, don't get me wrong, other places might end up uh, causing great damage. Um, let's be a little more careful with this great admiral. Uh, other cities might be extremely important to his uh, cultural output, but I'm not really sure how I can find out which ones. This is actually a lot slower than I would like. Uh, but we do have plenty of room to get other guys into position. Uh, let's actually just line them up and they'll be ready for the next go around. I should keep an eye out for where the logistics men are. Uh, there's one. Also, something I could do, I could get them into... Uh, yeah, let's uh, push on with those guys. I could put them inside this ring here. They don't have to be as far back as they are. It's like I'm being extra safe with them pretty much. So if you have full health, <clears throat> if you have full health, and I don't care too much about your life, hop into that ring of death, please. Logistics, I do care about your life. So we'll send him in. <laughs> I guess that'll leave one cruiser maybe to follow up on this fleet. So remember, this fleet are better trained. Let's go back to that for a moment. I Where in the map are they? Okay, over here. Yeah, this tree are better trained than the ones I left. So that should uh, make... That should be important in some way. Aztecs, please. Come on, we're fighting the same people here. Just think it through. Oh, the Aztecs. I, I'm not going to leave him as far forward as that, now that I think about it. Because these guys could just scamper. Scarper. Whichever S word you want for surrender. And uh, just basically run away on me and leave me high and dry. No, that's not an S word. Uh, cargo ship. Uh, I couldn't be arsed moving them to the other city. So I'm just going to go ahead from here. I don't think it's even that. I don't think I can really get that much bonus sending my units from this city. It's just caravans that come into that city get a, a nice bonus. Oh, what the hell is this? Plus one happiness in capital for every two policies you have adopted. Plus one free social policy. Enemy spies cannot disrupt world wonder production in this city. Well, Let's build that in the capital, I think. Although the capital may not be my best city. You know what? I'll do uh, I'll do all this in between turns because I want to get... Uh, maybe I'm not allowed to build in the capital. Uh, I want to get lots of planes out. So I'll do that at the end of this um, turn. And I'll spend a bit of time on it. Now, for... Well, actually, which city will get this wonder? You know what, if he's the first finish his other things, let's go ahead, you can have that. Yeah, public works, yeah, I just wanted to get that off my screen there. Now, I can probably keep him here, but I need to get a, a heavier unit onto that tile, is that possible? So what I might need to do is move back uh, one of the artillery pieces onto the water. Um, yeah, let's just uh, get straight onto the water. And I think he can move all the way up. No. I wonder, how did I manage to get the other guy? There's a fort there. Huh. Okay, well, let's get him onto land anyway. You can run away, live another day. 
just it all depends on how much he has backing this force up. Okay, I gotta I gotta protect uh, that guy. It's not too bad. You don't have range, do you? No. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna send him on just a little mission around the outside. What else? Are these guys getting killed by someone by that tank? Yeah, I wouldn't have sent them over as low health as that. And we're we're we still have the Carthaginians helping us out, don't we? Okay. So help us out. You go first as well, so you will hit these guys. Maybe I can just go ahead and take uh, take it a little. I can't land on his territory, unfortunately. Now let's get aggressive. Let's land a machine gunner, logistics machine gunner. Okay, that's. Yeah, I need to keep that in mind, and maybe we'll earmark an artillery piece for down there. These guys really have nowhere to go right now. Yes, they do. Okay, range four artillery piece. Oh, how do I get on onto that top? Hmm. So maybe I can walk through this tile, so if I move him forward... Now, forget that. Uh, how about... Now, let's uh, let's have both of these fortify. I think they can maybe survive. And if they can't, sure, we have a bit of backup coming. No problem. I don't expect you all to live. Sir, you, you can do a job. Forget about why am I sending a tank on a <laughs> fact-finding mission up there? Okay, that's it. I was expecting a city around about here, so that's not too big of a surprise to me. Um, that's going to cause a bit of trouble. Not as many troops as I would fear. Uh, let's let's go back over the mountain there a bit. I don't see any planes. Is that the Wright brothers? <laughs> Wilbert Wright is there. Which is ironic because I was actually looking for planes. That's <laughs> that is quite funny, um, but it looks fine. I think great, great general is fairly safe in that spot. And uh, yeah, let's let's get some uh, cruiser. Maybe he can help out. Honestly, the cruiser would mostly only help out if it's going really badly for us. That's annoying. I have to say it's this. Oh, it's a holy city. Okay, well, that makes more sense. Um, that makes a hell of a lot more sense why we can't spread religion there. Okay, so it, it just fully does it. Um, and we have another two goes after that. That's a nice production boost out to our holy city. Okay. Pop into the water, and I think that's it. I'll do a. What I was gonna look at my cities for some reason. I'll figure it out while I'm there, and I'll come back to you. Another thing to note: I spent a quite a bit of money in between turns last turn. Just that was uh, speeding along all these uh, refi refineries. Um, speaking of refineries, we are hopefully gonna get some coal refineries just to get a small coal. Um, in the not too distant future, but it's a, it'll be a good way away. I made a little bit of a mistake. You can see my money has gone down quite a bit. I I started to set up a few planes to be built, and I thought, hell, why don't I just buy them in all the cities? So I bought, bought, bought. I bought three planes, thinking I had so much money, but I don't really have as much as I thought, um, unfortunately. It's a uh, which path is this guy going down? I guess we'll get more cover, and we'll see what uh, yeah we'll see what comes out. Because I, I I just want this guy to hang on in here while these artillery pieces uh, get a nice foothold. Sorry, which unit was killed again? Um, yeah, okay. So these half health uh, these half health units I'd left down here. Half health, half heartfelt. Ah, there's some, there's some joke there, I think. 
Okay, maybe... Unfortunately, these guys didn't seem to do all that much. Oh, yeah, I can't enter that territory. Oh, here's a fort I can enter, actually, that would... I think that would cut everything off. Unless he just backed out. This guy backed out, he got there. I might be in a bit of trouble, actually, in that regard. But I'd love to get an artillery piece onto land. Um... Another logistics piece, excellent. Okay, a tank uh, down here I think would help Mars a lot. Yeah, that's good. Um, machine gunner. I want to get as much range onto onto land as I can. Neither of these are particularly great range, but when you're, they are, they still, uh, <laughs> they're still level three. They're still range three, so that's pretty good. Now, I may... What's this upgrade? Um, yeah, so we're still just going after logistics on that one. So I could probably move him forward because there's a hill. But unfortunately that would mean moving my infantrymen, which are already hurting. What can you do from all the way back here? Right, you can do a job. Do I have a hill? I wonder... Okay, I can move him there and still attack. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, I can actually land somewhere else. I'm not sure where I could... Uh, yeah, I can actually still attack. I think I could have done something better there. But, whatever. Do I need to worry about that? I'd like a little more landing spaces. Uh, I think, yeah, I could move him up there. I didn't want to risk moving him out onto that tile. Although... Um, I think it might be better off uh, getting the infantryman onto land, but I'm not sure that's viable this turn. Okay, go back and heal if you can. And again, these guys can just hang out up here and we'll find a landing spot for them soon enough. Uh, Great General is fine where he is. Perfectly fine. But I'm not sure if I can do anything for you. I cannot... Uh, am I... Oh, I am in their land. Okay, I'm sorry. We can just go ahead and pillage in that case. Uh, although, it's I think it's often better to fortify... Okay, so next turn we will try and get this guy perhaps like onto one of these squares. I love I love this Muscle Man just to move. Just move. Uh, how about maybe landing up over here? Yeah, this is a good square to attack the city. You know what, there's I, I've just moved him into the water. Out of the water, unfortunately. But there is a, there's certainly work to be done there. So let's uh, move him around. Maybe... Oh, we already have a tank. Ah, there's no way to get back up with that rifleman there, unfortunately. That's annoying. That's quite annoying. I think that cruiser is going to be surplus to requirement. There's just nothing we can do with him. Still, we'll endeavor to figure something out. Okay, medic. Yeah, I guess he's healing this guy, but getting himself hurt in the meantime. Let's go back there. If this guy only has range 3, which looks like he does, it might entice him to move forward, uh, which might get the... You know what actually would be potentially worth my while? Taking one of these cities. Actually, while I'm here, let's demand some tribute. I'm, I don't think I'm going to take one of the cities, I, first of all, should say. But it could be really worth my while just to have the, the airbase. Um, that or I should look into if I can land on um, to rebase. 
Like, let's see where I can land. I'm nearly sure I can't land in an allied city. Not, not to mention that they are not allied cities. How about a fort outside of my territory? Doubtful as well. I, I just don't... I don't think I can land anywhere here. What I really need is an aircraft carrier. Or just to take this city. Like, oh, if I took this city... That would be, mean so much to me. Oh, we're in trouble. We're in trouble, people. Um, especially how how not fast this is going. That makes sense. Oh, revokes his quests. I don't blame you. I just um, just demanded uh, stuff off you for no particular reason. I'm not gonna lie to you. It was just the proof that I could. Uh, unfortunately, he just took damage. I wonder, did he take any damage from uh, this guy? Okay, one, two, three, and uh, we'll go four. Is that how many tiles away I'm hiding everyone? I guess it is. Is there a way around this coast? Yeah, I'm a bit surprised nobody's attacking. This uh, is taking a hell of a long time to do, but I think it's worthwhile. It worthwhile doing it. All right, here's logistics. Actually, I don't need to check logistics for all of them. I'll just uh, press the attack button twice and um, see if anything happens. Uh, all right, so I wanted to get you a little farther away. Apologies for this. Look, guys, text. This is your last chance. Okay, I'm gonna actually uh, move a couple of units to to deal with this ship. I can't. I can't continue to arse around it. Two logistic guys should do a uh, yeah, pretty good job on them, and I'll actually heal him up a little bit. Now, will we will we actually kill this guy? Uh, will we actually take this city this turn? I wonder. Has a distinct possibility. No. I could have actually used him to attack over there. Eh. I just don't have the ships to to spend attacking the city, uh, the melee ships. I mean, just to get even this last sliver of health. So I think I would rather just wait, um, wait until next turn. He'll take a bit of damage there, but that's fine. Yeah, I think I'd rather wait until next turn before I kill um, kill this guy. I still think I still think I should potentially just skip the city entirely. I think it's probably for the best and I guess this guy is gonna go up here and explore on fishing boats we're looking for fishing boats no reason I'm not here to pillage I am here to pillage to be honest Okay, uh, once we get a foothold, well, I want Levante, and my happiness needs to be worried about. But in saying that, I do have a bit of happiness I think I can get in and around my cities. Um, yeah, I'll worry about that. I'll worry about that in between turns. I'm gonna. I might just throw him into the water because I. I don't think it's gonna get used. Wow, he's already won it back. The AI is a beast. 26, um, this guy did. And it's already gone. Well, I'm going to move on to Seoul. Uh, because I think it's just more efficient getting rid of that many. I can send in normal missionaries afterwards to do a job here. Uh, that was the last one. 
in saying that, um, I am going to build, buy, steal, and borrow, whatever the word is, some great dip. No, let's do this one city at a time. Uh, let's get a few of those guys in there. So I was looking for a great profit. I reach, recently bought one, so I'm not allowed to buy another. I see. Uh, I guess I'll just move the planes up here. Um, oh, did he actually move? Oh, he did. So I, I thought I was pressing the wrong button there. Uh, let's let's just grab some culture. I think I need every bit I can get. Okay, in that case, I can just click on there, even though it comes up red and flying, I cannot. There we go, that is actually a lot easier to move those guys. Um, I don't see who needs moving. There you go. Okay, so let's let's keep this guy around I am in the home base. And I clicked on that, but good thing I didn't, because I did want to have a look through the cities and sort a few things out. So I'll see you guys uh, starting the next time. In between the turn, Dido um, had a strange discussion with us. Not a strange discussion. She demanded I send my missionaries elsewhere. Now, I intended to tell her, get stuffed. I'll send them where I please. So I clicked on the, the icon on the top of the two options. But it turns out that was the friendly one. And <laughs> she was like, oh, thank you very much. But I am going to send the missionaries there anyway. Because this city is primed, and uh, this city is now oh, still primed. Um, I thought he had one more turn left, but it looked like he had disappeared. It's going to be fairly hard to actually capture that. I shouldn't spend too much time uh, with that. Ooh, that would suit me quite well. If the, would it suit me that well? No, I'm going to take this city, and I'd like actually to use this city as a naval base. So no, it wouldn't uh, suit me all that well. But I don't think I have to uh, take out... I don't have to spend everything on hitting the city, though. But uh, we should be able to take the city without any um, great problems. Uh, we'll even <laughs> take out this unit here just because we can. But we don't have to move back now. Right, who wants to... Let's send a low health person in that can then heal. Um, you're the only person that can heal of these guys. And uh, even though we just moved our planes, uh, we'll move them here again. Right, we needed this money, so that was actually very useful for us. But we will go ahead and puppet this city, I'd imagine. A lot, lot of interesting looking stuff there, but... Uh, puppet this city, our happiness. Oof. Right, let me... Yeah, I'll do this on camera, because it shouldn't take us too long to find a bit of happiness here and there. Uh, but no more attacking until I get this done. Okay, what... What are you looking at? Uh, boarding party. What's navigator do? Nah, we'll just uh, stick with boarding party there. And we have a dead unit as well. So we had him in the fort. He did his job though. He kept everyone else safe. I don't see necessarily who attacked him though. That's a bit of a problem for us. Oh, I'd love to be in that square. Yeah. Well, before we do that, let's get ourselves that happiness, because we're currently losing about 10% in strength. Right, uh, I think... Let's get public works. We have a few of these. I already started building a few of these around the place. So the happiness of this city is okay at the moment. Um, let me think about this. I might, I might not want to cut down his happiness... Actually no, I already I've already gone through the other city, so let's uh, try and get a bit of this here and there. So there's cases like this where taking some of these away doesn't change happiness at all. This is what you're missing out in between a lot of turns. I go through a lot of these guys. I might have to go back to the capital actually. 
I, I think I have one up here that's thrown out a bit of um, unhappiness without any need for it. Yeah, I could be in a bit more trouble than I thought. There's a free specialist we put up. So this one, I think I can reclaim a little bit here. No? Alright. Yeah, it'll have to be the capital that gets me... Uh, no, here, here it is. Let's see. Here we go. But uh, he was about to get a musician through. Get it through in three turns anyway, and that'll get us the happiness we need. Okay. That's fine. Okay, here's what we're going to do. This um, this machine gun man's going to come into this spot. The artillery piece is going to come into here. I guess we will land... <laughs> we'll land these two infantry men because I don't think this is going to work. <laughs> so they are going to save my ass. Actually, this is a terrible idea. That tank's just dead, isn't it? Maybe not. Let's not let them take me too easy. Okay, okay. Bro, we might have to. We might want to move him away. Now we'll probably just take the hit here while we can. Another tank can come in and look. I don't think they can kill both tanks, so let them kill one. Like it, it doesn't matter which one now at this point. Maybe. <laughs> okay, we might be able to. We might be able to use this fort to land a few more people. Um. I'd have to kill him first, though. Well, let's do it. And uh, because I've I've pushed in in this, I've pushed in in the south, so I'm gonna have to push in in the north. Otherwise, uh, those guys would be left uh, too exposed. Okay, here's a spot about to open up. Now let's we may as well open up another one while we're there. Ooh, yeah, that machine gunman can get a long way inland. I might have been able to do the same with the tank. In fact, I still can do the same with the tank. Excellent. Yeah, unfortunately, I just can't get past that uh, one rifleman. If only I could talk to him. Just say, dude, I just need you to move one position. Like, it's nothing personal. <laughs> it's just I need you to move that one position. And you're not doing it for me. So these two guys are going to back uh, them up when, when and if they have to retreat. Hopefully they can leapfrog them and get a good line of defense. Uh, in fact, maybe I should... No, you've already you've already pillaged there. Yeah, this is not ideal, is it? This is not ideal, really. God, oh, there we go. I don't know what they lost. Well, I can guess, though. They lost this massive city. I guess that was uh, giving them quite a bit of tourism. Um, must be another factory here because we still were short even more coal. We built way more than three of these offices. Let me have another quick read of this. Um, so, uh, Hexon office. When training militaries, plus one oil and plus one coal for every three refinery franchises up to your franchise limit. I'm not seeing it. Where is this coal? Where is this oil? Because uh, I've built four or five at this point. Every trade route from this city to a foreign city with a refinery franchise increases the city production. Interesting. Okay. We need to... Well, I don't think we're able to export. Um, are we? Yeah. I don't think so. Okay, we'll worry about that some other time. Actually, there was one little thing I wanted to check. My corporation. How many franchise? My franchise limit. That sort of thing. So does it tell me here? So I have seven offices. Where's my bonus? Franchise. Okay, I'm a little confused. Um, office. An additional oil and coal for every three franchises. So what's a franchise? How do I get a franchise going? I'm not really sure. Uh, 
I should probably do a bit of reading on it in between videos. I say that, but I'm probably not going to bother. I'm going to figure it out <laughs> the long and slow way. Can we... Yeah, that general will cover uh, quite a bit more there. Uh, what is this? Look at this barbarian tank. That's what you like to see in the world. <laughs> barbarian tanks just roaming around the place. He must have done something to piss them off. Um, he must have his people unhappy, something like that. Okay, yeah, I don't think there's anywhere you can get there. We're going to have to rearrange everyone in those spots at some stage. Planes. I wish I could move them in a group. Uh, I'm not sure... Oh good, they remembered where uh, they were in this. I'm not sure they're going to have the range though. Like for example, a triplane certainly I don't think is going to have the range. Uh, I can't remember what button it is to bomb. It doesn't seem to be B. I remember it to be different. We'll figure that out at some stage in the future. Okay, so what do I have to do here? I think I want to take Levante. Actually, Levante is not my enemy, but I want to take it because I want the oil. Tree, sorry, coal. I want to take the tree coal. It would also be a nice base. Maybe I just go straight. No, I, let's do this a little slower, a little safer. Because of this. 90%. We just gained 4 or 5%. I, I'm less at risk for losing um, due to a cultural victory. So let's take this city. We want the coal. Um, it's a nice base. It allows us to take probably a few cities around there. This one will be enough. And then we can move on to the capital. Yeah. Uh, this feels like more of a logistics effort, so I'm going to move these ships. Uh, no, actually no, because there this could be a fight at any moment. So let's uh, move in ourselves. Um, I think this should be enough. I'm going to try and just avoid this city. It looks like the Carthaginians are going to help me out. So what I'm going to try and do, because yeah, remember we're not at war. I'm going to just try and move all my units so they can make one wild dash um, through this strait without getting too much within range of that city. Uh, he does not have access this side. I just want to get my troops through here. And I don't really want to bother attacking. I want to spend everything attacking Levente. I want to take it quick. Here. You can stay up that end. I don't see any fishing. We'll go have a look at this ourselves. Now, unfortunately, there's no fishing boats up there at all. You're probably not going to get healed until until we find more coal. The cruisers can, of course, go ahead and heal though. Yeah, let me let me do a cut here, and I'll continue moving this, and we will uh, we'll do the end turn thing and all in the cut. So next time you should see me is the next start of the next turn. So see you then. Right, big news in between turns. The Aztecs have finally agreed a peace deal with us. Actually, let's uh, go ahead and trade them. Have they got money? They do. All right. How about an embassy? Proceed. Excellent. Uh, nutmeg, cocoa, don't mind if I do. I need uh, the happiness. And uh, let's say about 26. What do you say? Wow, okay, let's go 29. And 27. I need. I do need every penny at this point, unfortunately, so <laughs> bear with me on that one. Okay, good deal. Now, we took a bit of a battering at the hands of the Ottomans. Oh, we have a few promotions for us, actually. So we are... We have logistics there, we're heading out for range, so accuracy, excellent. Need to be a little careful. Wait, plane got promoted? Oh yeah, the one I built. Okay, that makes more sense. I was like, what What plane got promoted? How on earth did this happen? And let's go ahead and buy myself a cargo ship, and it looks like we lost some somewhere. Okay, so... What is this guy? He's a triplane, so we want for intercept. I think 
I think I had a look at that and I want to go out dog fighting and to range. Because I want to sweep out the area with my fire planes and then my bombers can come in and do the damage to the city. So that's basically my uh, theory. Dog fighting on fighters, um, city, city attacking on bombers. Let me know if that's blatantly wrong. Okay, so what did we lose up here? We lost a rifleman. Unfortunate. We lost a Zeppelin. Got a bit cheeky with him in fairness. And we lost one of these tanks that we knew we'd lose. Actually, we didn't lose that much behind the tanks. And of course, a peace deal there. Uh, let's have a extra... Do we have access to this? Yeah. That's just Cartage has global monopolies on a lot of stuff, it would seem. Cartage is a powerful, powerful uh, sieve. It's just missing its capital, unfortunately, for them. Um, I wouldn't like to be in the Ottomans' shoes at war with both of us. But they were so close to a cultural victory. I think it's gone for them now, though. Okay, floods or we lose production. Yeah, let's go ahead and lose production. Maybe floods would have been better, though, in that case. I'm not sure. Uh, we have plenty of money again. In fact, we have so much money, we might go ahead and just buy some planes and stuff. Right, how are you... Set. What's your attack here? Intercept. I. What do? What does this do? Does it go any range? You gotta give me ra some range here, mate. How about I? So. What happened there? <laughs> Did I already use him? I don't know. Uh, so bomber. How do you attack? Oh, airstrike S. There we go. That's what we want to see. That is not what we want to see, though, unfortunately. So you're not going to be of any use to me um, until you've got your range built out. Let me remind myself what I did in these guys. Him, I accidentally went for air logistics. Now <laughs> that I, I thought I had a fire. So here's what my plan is for bombers. Ah, so he does have range, actually. So, Ooh, so close. Not going to be able to do much there. But this city should uh, give me some something. Okay, we'll just put them all asleep in that case. Uh, let's. We'll come back to these guys and we'll try and get them through the straits here. It does look like the Ottomans are in a bit of trouble over here especially. In fact, they, they have nuclear weapons. I've not even considered their nuclear weapons. Okay, let's ignore this area. We'll do this at the end uh, in between processing time. Um, maybe just uh, have a quick look at some of these land units I see here. Yeah, nuclear weapons. Wow. Hopefully he won't use them on his own territory. <laughs> but who knows? And he he, um, he has he's only guaranteed to have one, in fairness. Aircraft stationed here. Bomber. Okay, they have bombers. Uh, you're back in the game. Okay, you can land here or everyone can move up. It's it's not ideal the positions they're in. Um but I think I need to do whatever I can right now. Okay, so my new plan for these guys up here. It's a bit controversial, so bear with me on this one. We're no longer attacking. We're going to do damage. We're going to do exactly what we're going to do, what we're doing right now. We're going to hold the line, and we're going to just harass. We're waiting for the Navy, because I don't feel I'm in as much of a hurry anymore. I'm going to wait for the Navy to come through here. But maybe I just go straight for the capital. But I really want a base. I'd certainly take Ankara here, Ankara, Ankara before taking Istanbul, because I really need the aircraft base. That's why it's so tempting, maybe just to take Milan or somewhere. Um, yeah, I'm still not sure. Maybe I just bypass here, because it looks like the Carthaginians will get me safe passage through this choke point. Once I'm through here, 
Okay, we're doing that. We're going to just skip this city. We're going to uh, go all out for Ankara with a sea attack. It's it's accessible. It's not great or anything, but it is accessible. Uh, we can amass all the cruisers out around here. Can't get too close to Istanbul. Probably has range 4 attack. Can't get too close to this city. Might be worth taking it first. We'll, we'll certainly clear it out uh, all the... You, you know what? If, if our ships get damaged, they get damaged. We're taking this city as fast as we can. Okay, so that's the plan. Uh, let me stay over here. Because I've got to move all these ships. Um, and I've lost where I am completely. Let's restart from the map. Let's go back home. <laughs> completely lost where I was. So we're going to... I'll move all of these in between turns. We're, you'll, you'll see. We'll come back to that though before that. Before I lock that decision in. Um... So I'm a bit more worried about down south. So if any of these artillery pieces can hit down there, we'll probably use it. Yeah, let's... Uh, that might have been a bit stupid, actually. I think I might need to fall back. But I certainly don't want to fall back. Whose, whose land are we in? That's good. That's good movement. Uh, is there any chance of open borders with the Carthaginians? No, it doesn't look like it. Okay, let's uh, move up here anyway. Let's do the. Uh, I thought I might get a hit in. Um, yeah, I still would, I think I'd rather maybe more help up there. If I can get, uh, oh, I can, I can get him right there right now, excellent. Okay, he has more chance to survive this. Uh, I might want to fall back a little bit. I'm just hoping my Cartoonian uh, best friends here can help me out. I can't help myself. I'm going to, I'm going to just kill someone if it's there. I didn't even realize I'd be able to fall back, but that's perfect. Uh, is there anything I can do? No, he'd have to go the whole world around. So we'll just put him asleep there. Maybe maybe he'll he'll find a use. We'll find a use for him in the end, but so be it if we don't. Okay, I'd like to just pop across this border all in one go if I can. Sorry, I forgot to look what I'm doing here. 21. Oh, that did do a lot of... Uh, that boosted it a lot. So 18. Just two of them then. And we'll have the other guys go somewhere else. Eighteen. Okay, the AI... Oh, I could have probably just gone there. Uh, the AI is strong when it comes to spreading religion, but they're not infallible. Is this the last thing I have to do? I could probably do this in edit time. I can't think of anything else big. Money's looking a bit bad. Happiness is looking a bit bad. I've already lined up a few of these public works in between turns. Basically, the overview of what my cities are currently building is... Um, They've all got one of these offices nearly already, I would say. Office is open 13 out of 23. That's pretty nice. That franchise opened up for us. That's uh, nice as well. I guess, does every office get one of these? Every office gets one of these for every tree franchise. So that is a lot of coal and oil, if we can get some of these franchises, which we do have trade missions out. I think that's how we probably get them. So, um, so I'll just leave it at that. Or maybe they have to send trade stuff to us. Anyway, the other things, um, we're building public works, and after that, I'm going to probably just go into arts or something like that. So I'll see you at the other side of the turn. Right, we got a technology in between turns, <clears throat> which made for a longer transition. Not that you guys would have noticed. Uh, we got uh, electricity, so we have refueled aluminium. I don't know myself where, though. 
Let's find out. Uh, the worker should get right on all of this. I wonder... Ah, it doesn't cycle through them all. Unfortunately for us. I wonder are we sitting on any already? We are. Or citadels are sitting on them or something like that. Or we just happen to have a mine built where they will be built. All that is uh, handy for us. Uh, we can... But we'll go figure out what we can do. Right, upcoming things. We're trying to sanction the Ottomans. Not as important anymore. Uh, going for United Nations. Uh, so it allows us all to build it. Okay, that's going to be... I have to keep an eye on that one. I have a history of forgetting that sort of thing. And to ban copper. I don't really care about any of that. I will try and ban the Ottomans just... I think we're say I think we're winning the game now, to be honest with you. I think we have the culture under control. We're gonna make a good hit on his city. Um, but it's something we definitely wanna keep our eye on. Now, what else happened in between turn? I I let me think. Went through all the cities, spent a bit of money. I want to I want to break free. No, that's not what I'm saying. Uh Coal refinery and stock exchanges are being built in all the cities. Well, they've been lined up. I'd love to finish them in the capital first, uh, just to give them the extra boost everywhere else. So money's been spent, and they've been lined up in most of the cities. That should give me plenty of coal any minute now, which will help out. Ah, that was the other thing that came to mind. Aluminium. Upgrade. Light tank. I like the look of them, basically. Right, we got one guy killed. Did I not have a second over here somewhere? Are you a city? No, you're not a real city. What are you doing here? Land ship. Can land ship be promoted? Nope. Uh, well, let's get you in the war. Okay, so how did we fare over here? Those guys, I don't, I didn't see any death notices. Yeah, I hope I didn't delete any without realizing it. I think we're looking pretty good. That machine gunner, those two machine gunners, particularly the logistics guy here, are beasts. They're going to do great jobs for us. Uh, do I just sit here and hope for the best, or do I move forward? I think it's worthwhile moving forward, if for no other reason it gives me an excuse to move an artillery piece forward. Let's see you fall back. How about you? You don't need to move forward at all, do you? Do you know what? We'll do it anyway. Oh, that's not free. That's not a hill, is it now? How is there no hill there? It looks so high. Um, yeah, I thought I was getting a free movement just to reach more things. I will attack the city if necessary, but I'll attack the units first. Oh, you need moving. You need moving. Maybe into this spot. I don't have the melee units to back this, that, that kind of push up though. Um, you know what I need actually? A second anti-aircraft gun. Let's get him over here. And maybe we'll build one as well while we're at it. Okay, these guys don't have much, much longer in the world. Just do what we can. Uh, we want to we want to spread this uh, franchise thing. I think uh, these uh, these cities closer at home will be a little more will be more likely to take it. Is my plan? If if I <laughs> if I said that in any way coherent in any coherent way. Okay, good. And remember, these we don't have to attack. Let's sit back. Make it easy. I, ho I hope we don't lose everybody. I don't hope we don't die. But it's not, uh, it's not the end of the world. You know, as it seems to be quite... Let's try and get him into, say, this spot here. Um, I'll just try and heal up. Let's heal up a bit farther away. And I'm not sure his range. I'm hoping it's about three. I think you have to go into this page to find out. So range three. Uh, yeah, so that's a 
bit of a blanket I'm giving him. It's not insurmountable though. Okay, did I see this city needlessly? Wait, holy city of Islam. Oh, that's what you had. You had Islam, I understand now. My bad. Uh, I think I'll just spread it here. Just give him more to push back against. Okay, I guess I'll end the video there. I'm really curious how this will end up, though. So I moved these units twice in between the edits. And uh, they're ready... They could get a hit or two in next turn, but more likely I'll just station them around the city and we're going after Ankara. Once Ankara falls, planes, we're just, planes are going to sweep in here and we're going to use them to probably take out these cities first. Um, land units are going to sweep in and boom, we're done. Istanbul. Uh, just to skip on a little more, what are we left with? This city and... Um, Oh, we need this one here, and we need this one. It might, uh, after taking these cities, we might have the potential to get a diplomatic victory, looking at how many votes we had uh, going for us last time. So anyway, all that's uh, in our future. We, if it is a military victory, it should we should sweep it fairly quickly. Accessible, no problem. Um, not very accessible, actually. These two, that's going to take us a bit more time. Like, we're going to have to... I don't know. It's actually going to be a bit awkward. So, tune in next videos to find that out every day, 2 o'clock. Hit the subscribe button down the bottom left, um, if that's the sort of thing you want to do. And a playlist, bottom right, is the current playlist, Roman with the Romans. And the previous playlist, can't remember the name of it right now. Vikings, I want to say something for the Vikings. Bloody Bluetooth. Check that out. And I'll, until next time, have a good one. Bye.